A big watch. We're having fun. Mars, a rich destination for scientific discovery. As we expand our presence into the solar system with robotic and human exploration, the formation and evolution of Mars will help us learn more about our own planet's history and future. In its past, the red planet had conditions suitable for life, and future exploration may uncover evidence of life, answering one of the fundamental mysteries of humanity. Does life exist beyond Earth? At NASA, we're reaching for new heights so that we remain the world's leader in space. We're pioneers and we always have been. and We're building on that pioneering spirit in science and technology so that we make the world a better place and we create jobs right here on Earth. NASA is developing the capabilities needed to send humans to an asteroid by 2025 and to Mars in the 2030s. We're building something that can go lunar, we can build something to go to an asteroid, we can go to Mars with this. This is the next step that we've been looking for since the Apollo era. Robotic explorers have studied Mars for more than 40 years. NASA's path for human exploration of Mars begins in low Earth orbit aboard the International Space Station. On board the orbiting laboratory, astronauts are helping us prove many of the technologies and communications systems needed for human missions into deep space. Well, the crews right now on the International Space Station are using this wonderful outpost to help us get farther and farther into space, to asteroids, to, to Mars eventually. I think the science on station is making incredible breakthroughs that are going to help us make life better for people right here on Earth. We and our other international partner crewmates are working off the planet for the planet. NASA, along with our international partners, conduct scientific research every day here on the station as we use this orbiting laboratory as a stepping stone for future deep space exploration. In tandem with space station research, NASA will send a robotic mission to capture and redirect an asteroid to orbit the moon. Astronauts aboard NASA's Orion spacecraft will explore the asteroid and return to Earth with samples. This experience will help NASA test new systems and capabilities, such as solar electric propulsion, which will send cargo as part of human missions to Mars. NASA's new space launch system will enable these proving ground missions to test new capabilities. Human missions to Mars will rely on Orion and an evolved version of the SLS, which will be the most powerful rocket ever flown. With Orion and our heavy lift space launch system, we're gonna send humans into space farther than they've ever gone before. This year's Orion test flight will be the most aggressive for a human spacecraft in more than 40 years. Apollo happened before I was born, so this for our generation will be uh, the exploration missions that we get to see in our lifetime. A fleet of robotic spacecraft and rovers are already on and around Mars, dramatically increasing our knowledge about the red planet and paving the way for future human explorers. Future missions seeking signs of past life will demonstrate new technologies that can help astronauts survive on Mars. I think some of the most amazing things that we're learning are actually how to be really good detectives on another planet, which is a really difficult job. Engineers and scientists around the country are working hard to develop the technologies astronauts will use to one day live and work on Mars, and then safely return home from the next giant leap for humanity. Through advanced aerospace technologies used in everything from modern aircraft to suborbital rockets and the commercial vehicles servicing low Earth orbit today, we're building the machines to take us farther into the high frontier. NASA is here to raise the bar for human achievement. We are a community dedicated to research and discovery in service to society. We have a responsibility to the future generations, to, to the future generations of engineers, scientists, technologists, explorers. That's our challenge. 